up everyone? Since we're going to be doing more Azure stuff, I wanted to show you how to sign up with Azure for free and get $200 in credits to try stuff out. But first, be sure to subscribe to the channel, and if you like code porn and want to support the show, visit our Patreon page. When it comes to the free trial, you have full access to all of the features until you use up all of your credits. After that, you can go with a fully paid subscription, or you can get a basic free subscription which will have limited offerings, but it's still useful for playing around and trying things out. So let's get started by going to azure.com and click on the big green start free button or click on the free account text. You'll end up at the free account details page. So you can read through this if you like, or just click the start free button to continue. You'll need to log in with your Microsoft account. If you don't have one, you can go ahead and create one. Once you have correctly entered your credentials, you'll end up at the sign up page. Fill in your details and click on next. At this point, you have to verify that you are a real person. I just did this by entering my phone number and had a code sent to me via text message. Next up, you'll need to add a credit card. Don't worry, you won't be charged for anything. This is not like other free trials where you get charged after the trial period ends. In this case, you must explicitly convert to a paid account before you get charged for anything. I've had a card on file for a long time and I've never been charged. And once you're done there, click the agree checkbox after you read through the terms and conditions, of course. Now your subscription is being set up. It doesn't take very long, but while you wait, you can watch the tour video, which I do recommend. When it's ready, you'll see a Start Managing My Service button. Go ahead and click the button, and you'll end up in the Azure Dashboard. At the top of the screen, you'll see a notification pop up that says you now have $200 in credits that you can start using. You can see what your current usage is at all times, which is really nice. At this point, there isn't anything to show because it's a brand new subscription, so it'll just sit here and spin for a while. But you'll end up seeing something like this here. If you plan on creating resources like VMs, be aware that they eat up a lot of credits, so be sure to turn them off when you're done, and don't let them run overnight unless you have it performing some kind of work. I ran out of credits after three days while testing a VM once, so it does happen. Some resources cost money only when you use them, and other resources like storage cost no matter what. All right, that's it for this episode. Be sure to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on future Azure fun. And if you like this video, click that like button or leave a comment and let me know what you think. Thanks for watching.